hear the motto, Virginia's finest, um, but apparently Utah is finest now. So you made the move out when? Yeah, in uh, July. Yeah, my family and I moved out full-time Park City, Utah in July. Tell, tell me about it. It's been incredible. Like, we got off the plane and seen the, like, the mountain background, like, it felt like a big backdrop. It's just, like, majestic. Yeah. But it's been really cool to try a new training style with a new group and at altitude. Yeah. All of that is new. Um, but it's been a really fun transition and exciting just to, like, you know, stimulate your body in different ways. What's been, like, the most, your favorite part of that move so far? I think having, well, Ed as a coach has been awesome. Having the whole team. Like, I feel like I kind of been figured out on my own for a while and to have just a whole collection of people all striving for similar goals it has been really really cool just to be surrounded by that um, so yeah I really like the team and the community aspect what does that it, it, like what does that allow you as a professional runner to have a team surrounding you? well I think one just like training with a group of people is great like I feel like you can get into places and workouts and long runs um, you normally wouldn't get to by yourself I think just the positivity and accountability of having other people like somewhere with you next to you at workouts has really helped. Um, and I think you can learn from other people. You know, when you're having a great, good day or a bad day, you can like look at what other people are doing and that can help like strengthen you up and learn lessons from them or you know, people support you. So is this your first like team environment since college? No, it's been a while. Yeah, it's been a really long time. Wow, I'm happy to And obviously, nice change of scenery from Virginia. Um, I think last time I saw you, you were doing the 10K. Reflect on that. Like, how about how was that whole phase? You know, it was it was cool, and I'm glad I went for it. I had a hard time staying healthy this spring, so I was kind of battling injury after injury. And I think kind of switching over quickly from marathon to like speed work for me, I think, was hard. Um, but I'm so thankful I got to run at Hayward Field. I got to participate in the Olympic track trials, and that was really cool. Yeah. Um, I'm sure you felt the love out there. I felt the love. Um, not the race I was hoping for at the Olympic trials, but um, I think the race that I kind of earned the season throughout the like, injury. So. Yeah. But yeah, so I think, you know, in track, I really, I feel like I was being put streets and like a feral cat, like I belong on the streets. So excited to be back to the Yeah. Uh, Chicago, and, uh, where, where'd you head out with it? You know, it's been a great film. It's been my first time at altitude. I've done a lot of volume. I've been really healthy and I'm fit, but I just don't know what it all means yet. So I think coming from altitude, I don't know, I don't know that translation. So like before, I think like this workout means this, which means I'm in this shape, and I have no idea right now. So maybe I'm in a different shape, maybe I'm not, but we'll find out on Saturday. Best of luck. Yeah, thank you. Have fun.